Hey everybody, it's Bradford. If you can't see me, I'm in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. I want to talk to you about some Flipgrid uh, pictures or drawings if you want to put in your grids or for your topics. So as you know, Flipgrid has some amazing backgrounds that you can put into your Flipgrid or your topics. But what if you want to just create your own? And what if you don't want to crop it? What if you don't want it that same size? And you don't want to do it in any other program, but maybe you want to do it in Google. I think I have the solution for you. So in the links that I provide, provided for you, I have a flip grid that's from a Google drawing and a flip grid topic and one with a border on it. So with those links, if you just click on one of them, we'll start with the flip grid that has no frame on it. So you click on that link, it'll force you to make a copy. And once you're there, it'll automatically take you to, it'll take you to your own copy of a flip grid grid with no frame. As you can see here, it's a sample title. And look, it says you need a Google account to make a copy. So just FYI, okay? So what you can do here is go on ahead. And if you see where it says click, view, guide, show guides, you're going to need to do that. So make sure you go to view, guides, show guides. And there is a reason for that, okay? Let's say I delete all of these. I don't need that anymore. I want to create my own stuff. And I just want to, you know, paste something in here. So let's say I just find this Google image of this car that I like. Awesome car, right? Copy image. Then I'm going to paste that car here. Whoa, that's big. Notice that it's going through these lines. You don't want that. The reason why you don't want that is because your Flipgrid title that's already being made that you created will go across here. So we're going to shrink this down a bit. And then I'm going to paste the, some more cars everywhere else just because I want to. Again, this is just me playing around right now. And then I like it, I think it's great. I'm gonna go to File, Download, PNG. So now it's gonna download at the bottom of my screen or wherever it's gonna download to your computer. I'm gonna go to Flipgrid, okay? Then I'm gonna open my folder to wherever I have it downloaded. For this one, since mine is at the bottom, I'm just gonna put it down here and I'm gonna drag it. And I don't even have to uh, crop anything. I'm just going to just press the crop button. And then it automatically pops up right here. I'm going to update my grid. So take a look. It's already here. If I want to see it as a student would see it, I'm going to click view as student. And then as you can see, the title of my Google is right here. And then here are my cars. So you might have to find some better images, but this is just in case you want to make something of your very own. Now, what about topics, Mr. Harris? Not a problem. I'm going to go to one of my topics that I have here. Note, I've already had one I created, but I'm going to edit that, okay? All right, so I'm going to go here. I'm going to delete that topic. And then I am going to go to the one of the links that I've already made. It's actually called Flipgrid Topic, but it, it's a bit.ly for you in the Twitter. Make a copy. And as you can see here, here is my uh, Flipgrid topic um, that I can just go on ahead and do whatever I want to do. I can do my backgrounds. I can do whatever I want as long as I just don't go past the, um, the canvas here, okay? You don't have to worry about doing any um, guidelines here, okay? So let's just say I've, I, I have already this typed. I wanted to do something here. I can even go on ahead and if I want to, I can put a, another car here. Let's just go ahead and do that for right now. There's a car. Isn't that great? A couple other cars. Isn't that great? Let's make this one bigger. Awesome. All right. I want to download that. Download PNG. It's going to download wherever I download it into my computer here. I'm going to go back to my Flipgrid topic area where I'm making my edits. And then I'm going to upload my image. Since I already have it downloaded at the bottom, I'm going to drag that here. And then I don't have to touch anything. All I have to do is press crop. Now, once I press that, I'm going to update my topic. And it pops up right here. I can also do the same thing with borders. Okay. I'll show that really quick. I have that link as well for you guys in, in Twitter. Make a copy. Okay. Here's a nice border. Again, I can change the color. I can do whatever I want as long as I don't go past the canvas here. I'm going to download that. 
make sure it's a PNG. That will download. And then I'm gonna change this right here. I'm gonna go back to edit. Okay, delete my focus. Upload an image. Retrieve my image that I made in Google Drawing. I don't have to crop anything. I just have to press the word crop. Okay, update my topic. And it is there. If I want to view it, I can. Okay, and there's my grid, everybody, with my sample topic already ready to go. So again, those things are there for you. So if you want to create your own, you're more than welcome to. Or again, you can use what Flipgrid has provided for you. Just if you're feeling artistic, I have provided those things for you. So have any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks, everybody.